Hey there, pin pals. This is Evan from the Velveteen Stabit, and today we are going to talk about pin backs or the pin clutches that hold your pins in place on your clothes. There's three types. There's the uh, the classic butterfly. There's the more modern vinyl, and then there's the locking pin backs. And these are our favorite, but we're going to start with the butterfly pins. You guys are all familiar. All you guys, all you got to do to operate these things is squeeze on those tabs. Now, it's important to note that these are really going to get their grip on the groove that's on the post. And if this post didn't have that groove, these would not work. Also, these are known to fail. Okay. So for example, if it rotates around like if your pin spins around for some reason a bunch of times it'll fall out also they can get if your pin gets snagged on a seat belt or a purse strap a couple too many times it'll just it'll work its way loose they can fail and it really sucks to lose a pin especially a really cool vintage pin like this this that would be hard to re replace uh, the next type of pin back is the vinyl pin back and these are probably our least favorite but they do have their merits. One of them is that they're smoother, so if it's rubbing on your bare skin, it's not gonna be as annoying. Another is that they can really get cranked down, so you can really push that cleat right there into your shirt, and that helps prevent the pin from rotating around. You know those pins that always wanna be upside down? Um, the vinyl back can really get that cleat stuck in there and keep it from rotating around. That way you don't have to be annoyed by fixing it all the time. The downside of these is that they wear out. That hole in there can really start to just get old and stop being pliable and then they just don't hold a good grip. Um, also, sometimes when they're brand new, they just aren't that great. For example, these black ones came with some pins that we were selling for a while, and they just didn't hold the pins on shirts very well. And some of our friends lost their pins. We had to we had to stop using those. Okay, the last uh, pin is the the last option is the best. It's the locking pin back. This is the vintage locking pin back that comes on some of the vintage pins. Uh, this is the more modern version. You can get these off of Amazon. Some pin makers will offer them as upgrades. Uh, sometimes we send these out as a uh, little thank you gifts for customers that are really nice to us, but not always, okay? So don't, don't, we didn't promise you anything. Um, there is, it, like, look at this post. There's no groove in it. This is an old tie post so that it doesn't screw up um, silk ties. It doesn't have that groove in there. So a butterfly clutch wouldn't even work on this post. This solid grip, that's really, that's on there. That's not coming off. The downside of this is that it, um, it's tricky to use, right? The motion to work it, like you gotta get a grip on it like this and then you gotta do this pinching motion where it's like, you gotta do it like this, right? You know what I'm saying? It's kind of like pulling a tick off of you except that's really not the best way to pull ticks off you but that's you know you know what i'm saying you're like you just get that motion you like squeeze it get it off all right so here is the vintage version of the same thing right that's what this pin is going to ship out with okay so like i said we got these off of amazon uh here's the other downside is that sometimes they jam up and sometimes they break when they jam up or break, it it kind of feels like that pin is going to be stuck in that spot where it's pinned for the rest of eternity. But I'm still going to recommend that. That's what Emily and I use on all our pins in our personal lives. So maybe that's what you should use too. Let us know what you think. You have any comments? Did we miss anything? There is one other type of pin clutch, but it requires tools and... I've never used it, and I don't think I'm ever going to use it. So, leave a comment.